Unit 7. Vocabulary. Page 82. Exercise 1. Listen and number. 1. That's a big polar bear. Oh, look! It's asleep. 2. Look at the lion. It's my favorite animal. I'm frightened. It says danger on the sign. 3. Look at the kangaroos hopping. They're really fast. 4. Look how slowly that tortoise is moving. It's so small. 5. Where do tigers and pandas live? Tigers live in the jungle, but pandas live in the forest. Poor parrots. They can't fly in a cage. Unit 7. Vocabulary. Page 82. Exercise 2. Listen, point, and say. Lion. Lion. Frightened. Frightened. Danger. Danger. Panda, panda, jungle, jungle, parrot, parrot, cage, cage, polar bear, polar bear, asleep. Asleep. Kangaroo. Kangaroo. Fast. Fast. Slowly. Slowly. Unit 7. Grammar. Page 85. Exercise 6. Listen, read, and choose. This is the gray elephant whose ears are big. That is the big panda that is black and white. This is the small monkey whose teeth are dirty. That is the giraffe that has a long neck that's right. At, at the, the zoo, zoo, at the zoo, zoo we, we are having so much fun here at, at the zoo. zoo. Is that the green parrot? That can say hello. Is that the brown kangaroo that jumps and never falls? I think that's the tiger that is brave and strong. And that is the vet who takes care of them all. At the zoo. 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 We are having so much fun here at the zoo. At the zoo. At the zoo. At the zoo. We are having so much fun here at the zoo. Unit 7. Story. Page 86. Exercise 3. Listen and read. A visit to the animal shelter. Seth and Emma are at the local animal shelter. They are interviewing Dr. Sullivan. She is a vet who is a volunteer there. What do you do here, Dr. Sullivan? I work with other vets who help animals that are sick, like Pinky here. What happened to Pinky? He looks frightened. Pinky is a rabbit who came here with a broken leg. I operated on him this morning. Poor Pinky. Do you have people who take care of some of the animals here? Yes, we do. But animals are a big responsibility. Can I take care of Pinky when he's better? I think Pinky will be happy at my house. No, he won't. No, he won't. Who said that? Not me. Not me. Oh, that's a parrot who has been here a long time. He's always unhappy and mean. I'm not mean. Take care of me. Don't worry about him. He needs people to love him and help him feel safe, too. Then he can come home with me. That's great. 
Children who want to help animals are the best. Unit 7. Listening and Speaking. Page 87. Exercise 3. Listen again and match. Thank you for this interview for our school paper, Dr. Sullivan. My first question is Why did you decide to become a vet? For lots of reasons. But the main reason is because I think it's the best job in the world. When I was a little girl, I had a cat that got very sick. We took the cat to the vet, and the vet was the person who saved him. That day, I decided I wanted to do the same thing. Interesting. What is your favorite part of your job? I like being around different animals. Especially wild animals like elephants, lions, polar bears, and giraffes. But the most important part is that a vet is a person who helps sick animals get better. Where do you work now? I work full time at the zoo, but I also volunteer at the local shelter on Fridays. And what's your favorite animal? I love lions. They have strong legs that help them run fast and which make lions very strong animals. What about you? My favorite animals are pandas. I'm a little frightened of lions. Really? And what do you know about pandas? Pandas live in China. They eat bamboo leaves and they're black and white. I saw them on TV. We have two pandas in the zoo now. You should come see them. Really? Are the pandas in cages? I don't like to see animals in cages. No. We try to find space for the animals to move around and make their space similar to their natural habitat. Sometimes it's difficult because bigger animals need more space than smaller ones. Unit 7. Vocabulary. Page 88. Exercise 1. Listen and number. 1. That owl is very smart. And the turtle is slow. 2. Be careful. It's not safe to stand too close to the lion. It's okay. I'm brave. Plus, he looks friendly. 3. The giraffes are really tall. Look! And they're very pretty. Unit 7. Vocabulary. Page 88. Exercise 2. Listen, point, and say. Careful. Careful. Safe. Safe. Brave, brave, friendly, friendly, pretty, tall, tall, smart, smart, slow, slow. Unit 7. Listening and Speaking. Page 201. Exercise 2. Listen to Seth talking to Dr. Sullivan. Check your answers in Exercise 1. Dr. Sullivan, can you tell me about rabbits? Yes, of course. What would you like to know? Do rabbits like to be with other rabbits? Yes. They live in big groups in holes in the ground together. What kind of food do they like? They eat wildflowers, grass, and vegetables. They love carrots. So they don't eat meat? No, they don't. Did you know they make a sound like a cat when they are happy? Pinky does that. He sounds like my mom's kittens when he's happy. He jumps a lot, too. Yes, rabbits can jump. They usually hop around when eating, but when they are frightened 
and feel in danger, they can run fast. What makes them feel frightened? When they see bigger animals or big birds, because these animals like to eat rabbits. Sometimes I see rabbits in the park. Do they live in other places? Yes. Rabbits are animals that usually live in lots of different places. Forests, grasslands like parks, or mountains. I have Pinky in a cage. Do you think he likes living there? Yes. I think Pinky needs a place to call home. But you need to take him out of the cage every day to get exercise and play with him. Thanks for the information. It's good to know Pinky is happy. I play with him every day. Unit 7. Listening and Speaking. Page 201. Exercise 3. Listen again and complete the notes. Dr. Sullivan, can you tell me about rabbits? Yes, of course. What would you like to know? Do rabbits like to be with other rabbits? Yes. They live in big groups in holes in the ground together. What kind of food do they like? They eat wildflowers, grass, and vegetables. They love carrots. So they don't eat meat? No, they don't. Did you know they make a sound like a cat when they are happy? Pinky does that. He sounds like my mom's kittens when he's happy. He jumps a lot, too. Yes, rabbits can jump. They usually hop around when eating. But when they are frightened and feel in danger, they can run fast. What makes them feel frightened? When they see bigger animals or big birds, because these animals like to eat rabbits. Sometimes I see rabbits in the park. Do they live in other places? Yes. Rabbits are animals that usually live in lots of different places. Forests, grasslands like parks, or mountains. I have Pinky in a cage. Do you think he likes living there? Yes. I think Pinky needs a place to call home. But you need to take him out of the cage every day to get exercise and play with him. Thanks for the information. It's good to know Pinky is happy. I play with him every day. Unit 7. Integrated Skills Review. Page 206. Exercise 1. Listen and complete. Use the words in the box. This is the gray elephant whose ears are big. That is the big panda that is black and white. This is the small monkey whose teeth are dirty. That is the giraffe that has a long neck that's right. At the zoo, at the zoo, we are having so much fun here at the zoo. Is that the green parrot that can say hello? Is that the brown kangaroo that jumps and never falls? I think that's the tiger that is brave and strong. And that is the vet who takes care of them all. At the zoo, at the zoo, at the zoo, at the zoo, at the zoo we are having so much fun here. At the zoo, at the zoo, at the zoo, at the zoo, we are having so much fun here at the zoo.